I'm a little low on oil, so I figured I'd add some to this, and I'm going to do an oil change here soon. So, let's see how good it cleans out. That should be plenty. It says an ounce for every quart of oil. Hey, it's Civic Boy here. I'm going to be doing an oil change today and showing you guys what um, sea foam looks like mixed in with the oil. I let it sit in there and I drove it for about 600 miles. And um, this is a 5,000 mile oil change right, that I'm about to do, so enjoy. I'm using different oil this time as well. I usually use Mobile One, but I went ahead and I'm going to try this and see if I like it. And I went with a cheaper oil filter as well. I usually buy K&N or Mobile One oil filters, but they're just so pricey. Um, I went ahead and went this route this time. So we'll go ahead and see how good these are, and I'll show you guys that oil as soon as I drain it out. Alright you guys. I changed my oil. I drove my car with sea foam in the oil for 600 miles, roughly. So I wanted to just show you the difference um, that what the oil looks like and what a normal oil change, a 5,000 mile oil change looks like. So as you see here, you can see this is the sea foam oil that I took out, and this is a regular oil change. Can't really tell the difference on camera. The sea foam oil is very strong. You can smell it a lot. You can definitely smell the sea foam in there. And the regular stuff is just doesn't really have a smell until you get really close to it. But they both just look very dirty, and I do want to get these tested. And I am going to save them both. And I have the oil from the mystery oil clean out I did. So.